us the ashes to Sorrow, grief, and sympathy are inevitable when one dies. But the circumstances in which 19-year-old Ruth Mbando died has left a lot of people shocked across the country. Scores of people attended a church service in memory of Ruth on Monday at the University of Zambia Chapel. Though her life was brutally cut short at the age of 19, Ruth was not only a student pursuing human resource management at NIPA, but she was also an active member of the Bread of Life Church. Her church members have described her as a God-fearing person. Oh, surely miss her. One thing that Ruth prayed for, that is the every day of her life was that Lord prepare me to be a sanctuary. And Batu's president has challenged police to ensure security in Emmersdale is looked into. He has also urged the Zambian people to carefully look at the clause in the constitution that talks about the death penalty. Her mother, Victoria Mbandu, wrote a touching farewell message to her daughter, which was read to on her behalf. Sweetheart, you went so early. I'm so empty because you are not only a friend but also a good companion. Today you are no more. I want to promise you that I will never stop trusting God. According to a post-mortem conducted by doctors at the UTH, Ruth died of brain hemorrhages due to multiple fractures caused by a head injury. Ruth was found dead in the early hours of Saturday 14th of July 2012 just three houses away from her mother's house. Police have since intensified investigation into the brutal killing of Ruth. Questions will still remain in the people's minds on why the assailant did this to her. And many have called for justice to prevail. Francesca Piribanda, Movie TV News, Lusaka.